so one of the things that is now available within IBM i7.4, there's, there's many different new features and functions that are appearing in 7.4, but one of the LPPs you can add on, if you want to, is the brand new DB2 uh, mirror for IBM i. Uh, that enables you to be able to do true continuous availability uh, for IBM i's instances uh, using high-speed Rocky Ethernet adapters to be able to communicate between the two different systems. It uses a brand new method of being able to do that synchronization of the data between the two D and instances of IBM i, uh, but so it, that's all new, but at the same time you can actually reuse considerable amounts of what you've got already. So you're able to use Power 8 or Power 9 systems, uh, you're able to potentially also use maybe uh, the, da the, da the synchronization at the storage level for DR, uh, but for true availability, true high availability, you're able to do this full active-active kind of world with IBM i delivers, as I say, continuous availability for, for these systems, true uh, zero RPO and zero RTO, because the writes actually come into both boxes and are written down to both at the same time. So there is no data loss at all, uh, and you can also have a whole system fail and be able to immediately access the other box without any outage whatsoever. One method you could use, after all, is using load balancers to be able to make sure that you're just moving between the two different systems, and then you just continue to work with the one that's running, and you'd have absolutely no outage whatsoever. Uh, alternatively, you can also use the JDBC kind of connections to be able to have that instance with it, with that server and, and move it across very, very quickly because it doesn't need to restart. Or there's no need to bring things back up again. It's already there and you can carry on using it. Another piece that you can also use this technology for is being able to have maybe an example of one, one system being used as the production workload. The other could be used to be able to have a, a kind of run reports against as both are, are running instances of IBM I. Both are actually full active active or, or can be. And so that's the kind of world that we're now delivering, which uh, we haven't necessarily had before. Where are very, very effective at lowering uh, the, the planned and uh, the unplanned outages. Uh, so the unplanned outages are things we've lowered a long way uh, and with these systems. It's still possible, but, but kind of pretty unusual. Uh, we've also been working hard to be able to lower the planned outages. And again, this new technology uh, is able to enhance our capabilities beyond what PowerHA could do on its own. Uh, it needs to be quite close to each other, but as long as you're within that 100 metre cable length of being able to keep the systems running, then you'll be able to avoid both the planned and the unplanned with this new technology and combine it with existing for DR.